Hi, my name is Julia and this is Space Daily News Channel. South Korea successfully launched its Nuri rocket on May 25th from the NARA Space Center. The rocket successfully delivered eight satellites into orbit. It was broadcast live on the Korea Aerospace Research Institute channel. The three-stage Nuri rocket is the first rocket entirely designed and built in South Korea. It has a diameter of 3.5 meters, a length of 47 meters, and a payload capacity of 3,300 kilograms when launched into low Earth orbit and 1,900 kilograms when launched into sun synchronous orbit. The Korea Aerospace Research Institute has been developing this vehicle since 2010. The first launch took place in 2021 when the rocket's third stage failed to place a mock up satellite into orbit. The second launch in 2022 was a success. The payload of about 200 kg was launched into the Sun Synchronous Orbit. During the third launch to the Sun Synchronous Orbit was launched 8 satellites manufactured in Korea, weighing about 240 kg. The main payload was 180 kg satellite NEXTSAT-2, which is equipped with a synthetic aperture radar. The other seven payloads are tiny CubeSats. Four of those seven satellites make up the SNIPE mission, which aims to study plasma in the Earth's ionosphere. The remaining three satellites will perform various tasks in orbit, from testing of a new control system of the spacecraft positioning to the measurement of cosmic radiation and weather research. The launch demonstrated that South Korea is capable of placing satellites into orbit using its own rocket. South Korea thus became the seventh country to independently develop a launch vehicle capable of launching a satellite weighing more than one ton into outer space. Joining Russia, the United States, France, China, Japan and India. By the end of 2027, South Korea plans three more launches of the Nuri rocket with various payloads. Space Daily News, like, share and subscribe.